I'm Victoria Devine, millennial money expert and the host of the She's on the Money podcast. And this is Talking Financial Wellbeing with Australian Unity. Today, I am joined again by Adnan Glinak, who is the Executive General Manager of Life and Super at Australian Unity. Adnan, welcome. I'm so excited to have you back. Hi, Victoria. Lovely to be back. I'm excited today to talk to you all about investing, what it means for millennials, what it means for your community and what it means for mine and how they all mesh together. So what's the difference between a more conservative investor and someone who's more willing to take on a lot of risk? In broad terms, um, if you took look at the spectrum, cash is the least riskiest um, or, or risk-free asset um, all the way to something as flavorsome as, as, as crypto and uh, on a scale of um, zero to a hundred, that's a good hundred. It is really a, a personal preference uh, and, and comfort uh, on how much risk you're willing to take. That could be all in into international shares, exposes you to a, a, a fair bit of risk to a, to, to a certain sector. So it's a, quite a personal uh, thing for everybody and you need to face into uh, understanding your own profile and your own willingness uh, and ability to absorb um, losses and, and still be okay that you can ride those waves through uh, for the ups and downs of investing. 